Now, Todd, that teacher called APD after the little girl came into school completely filthy and smelling terribly. She gave that girl some clothes to change into and noticed blood in her underwear. So why did that underwear end up in the trash and not in an evidence locker? We cannot catch and stop these people unless we actually do the DNA testing. When Keller took over, more than 5,000 rape kits remained untested across New Mexico, most in the Duke City. Since then, the mayor's helped secure funding and tested hundreds, a positive step in the right direction for victims. But a more recent case then has been grabbing headlines and shocking New Mexicans. A seven-year-old girl allegedly sold for sex by her parents. Left me with more questions than answers. A police report in this case says APD and CYFD responded to concerns from a teacher that a seven-year-old girl was being abused. That teacher found blood in the little girl's underwear, but... The cop threw the panties in the dumpster. What? So today, I asked why. No disclosure was made by the teacher of a crime that was committed, no disclosure by the child, and we had an incident call. So that officer made a determination through vetting it with crimes against children that that underwear was not going to be tagged into evidence because there was no crime committed at that point. APD is saying that neither the little girl nor the teacher directly said there was a crime. But we can see in the video that the teacher says... She was just so dirty. She reeked of... Of urine okay. and feces. So it sounds like, okay, and so this she, is a daily she, thing she smelled. She's concerned that the little girl is being abused, and she was concerned about the blood in her underwear. So tonight, this leaves us with even more questions. If the teacher telling officers she was concerned wasn't enough, what does it take for that underwear to be taken in as evidence? APD says they and the Attorney General's office are still investigating to find out just who dropped the ball. For Target 7, I'm David Carl.